And now, again, chasing by the chased by the by the clouds, which go together with another few more clouds and become a big white clouds, dark, and they follow me. Come on, come on, come to me, come to me. But I was run with the, my car faster as possible on these lovely roads, a beautiful, beautiful nature area. We are just about 20 kilometers away from Elena, which is that direction, and the village called Drenta. So I was running with my car as fast as possible, even there was a bendy roads during the mountains, beautiful one and good road. This one is even worse condition than the one bringing up to, to, to the village. So you can see the worst condition is looks even good. And to come to see this village, because there is a property for sale here, this view makes me to feel like the mountain is coming to me. I was just making like this. Oh no, don't go, don't go over me. <laughs> yeah, so we are in the village of Drenthe. As I say to you, this is the house we are going to put on the market with a garage and land, a small land in front, some land on this side and the land behind. I uh, don't know how much is the land. Uh, we'll have a look and see in the paperwork and we'll tell you in the advertisement later. Yeah, um, so I put uh, my uh, partner to start with the plants, floor plants. So we're getting serious with this. And some land here with this side. And this house next to, to this belongs to the mayor of the village, which is always good, let's say this way, as a proper electric. And a uh, few in Bulgaria, there is a three mobile operators and uh, one is A1, the other one is Yetel, the other one is Vivacom. Um, here in this village, A1 and Yetel has no receptions. So, but I've been confirmed by the mayor and the guy who's selling this house that they use here the Vivacom television and internet because their signal is, is good for this. And obviously uh, you can see the fence. So let's show you from outside the sizes and the, 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 the borders of the property. So this is where this garage finish, start the property with this fence, stone foundation with some metal post and net. You can see all this going all the way, including this garage which is very long, by the way, we'll go there inside and see it. And it has here the fence continue all this way. And it comes up to, I'll show you where it comes up to. Yeah, it comes up to like here, here. So you can see this concrete post with the electric, rusty electric box. And it goes straight away this way, you see? past the corner of this building on the trees and go up there there is a some fence there so this is I'll show now again go this way and that way we just seen it's a beautiful the land is a bit slope but still not bad this part here and you have another part from the other side the square of the village is not far away there is a small shop there as well which is good. So while I'm here, I'm zooming the roof of the house to show it to you. And uh, I will share with you uh, something which amazed me is the house floor plan. I have a lot of experience, maybe about already 15 years in that business, but not many houses can impress me and can surprise me, but this one really did. And you are going to see what I mean, okay? Let's bow back to the outside and look at the roof. I think you can see by the video where it was, where it was necessary being plastered, replastered the rich tiles. Very straight roof on very good condition. This side, okay. Let's put the zoom back a bit and go to see this one. Let's go. Yeah, we can see this one from this side. Now, I can hear a plane is flying. Uh, sorry. Okay, let me go here and here and here. I'll do my best. Yeah, let's zoom. I think you can see all the slopes are in a very good condition. And you're going to see underneath as well. 
so we'll be confirming it's a good uh, I think maybe I need to go this side a bit further to show you that slope or maybe I'm going into the garden and then show you the slope maybe it will be will be better uh, let's while I'm here let's show the underneath first okay yeah you can see one lot missing there but otherwise it's by the color of the paint you can see that it's, it was in a good condition for a long time even with this green green paint which was the color of the communism still in a good condition which can comes to say us the property were being looked after many years properly being looked after very properly all the, the years okay again yeah and the gutters conditions doesn't look bad as well I can say this and you can see there's another lot is missing there, but all the rest is in a perfect condition. Look at this, and the gutters are good, doesn't look rusty. Connecting pipes is going down and going here. Obviously put the water away and we'll go down to the cellar. You'll see really, really, really good condition. Okay, so let's have a quick look here of the other gutter. The same, you can see, zoom for you, proper proper shape and it's connected to the ground so obviously being very well looked after so this is the area in front of the house this is the road which road is i can't say it's a main road but it's the only road in the village so you can see while we're doing the video how many cars are going to pass or how many tractors or whatever and while i'm talking about this i just saw these pine trees there look at their branches amazing really really amazing i don't know how it looks on the video but it's really good looks in the reality they're very thick very thick and very dark green so here is an extra premise with another door so we have an access here to go into the property as well but we'll go there later because this house doesn't look like what you're going to see inside definitely will be totally surprised and you will see that this house has three or four entrances and all they are connected from inside so if you want you don't need to use these steps at all but you will see in the in the second video so this is the front the, the front garden and this is the side garden this is the the, the border here you can see this not bad space um just need the grass cutting of course and going this way follow there was connection there is connection between the mayor house and this house used to belong to our relatives in the past fence is over there you can see there's another building and there is a big barn which half of it is belongs to this property the other half belongs to the mayor property so this is the grass and we are going to see now here we have a back door which is good we have a water outside and sinks we have water inside as well so i'm going to show now again this is the back side of the garage can you imagine how long it is and can you imagine to concrete properly with tiles or maybe decking and make a balcony beautiful veranda and we'll have all this beautiful view even it's not overlooked by the neighbor house from the veranda you're going to have all this can you imagine beautiful so and i'm going through the nettle now burn my head my <laughs> my legs again but i want to show you so these trees are the border of the land this side so that's why when i went outside the road there if you remember i showed you this rusty electric box there so this is where the property ends and it goes all the way let me show you it goes all the way from here i will try to walk to mark the the border so it starts from here this concrete post and then go this way and go that way all this belongs to the property with the house etc the garage and you can see it goes this way 
so about a meter inside here maybe two going this way okay so let's go and see yeah i think these old these trees are in the garden anyway they are the border so you can see let's go all this way up to there up to there it is exactly yeah like this finish here so i think i'm falling down maybe so from here look at straight going this direction yeah and the house okay while we're here look at the view beautiful i'm going to zoom the roof and you can have a look really good condition chimney metal sheets around it perfect you can ask for more which is a good start obviously the property needs renovation but it's a good start with a good roof and don't forget the number of premises the number of access from one premise to the other the way the shape of the premises everything everything is connected from inside you go from one of the doors you want here or there or the front doors or the side doors and then you can go all over the house without going out beautiful so this is the border here you can see the end yeah with this big apple tree looks like apple tree yeah down there is a pear tree and then we're going to see the barn which is and look at this beautiful for, for I you agree with me it's beautiful for veranda very big very big even you can make a roof above it so you can use it during the winter as well you never know beautiful let's go and have a look at the buildings so yeah the net over there you can see the end so the shape of the garden is clear i think it's about maybe 1000 square meters maybe 1200 something like this but we'll check for sure so this is the half of the barn the other half so the barn is like the barn start here going this way up to here and it's inside you can see but it's actually finished there this is the end where the wood are so this beam is in the middle behind this beam is the mayor if before this beam is belong to here and you can see the condition is not bad even it's the same roof baby only yeah there's a one kind of a problem there with this rotten but it could be done easy because you have you have both sides strong so just put uh, an extra wood from here to there so you can make a type of like a bypass the rotten part look at this yeah good one really good one no question about it good condition and yeah you have one premise here like i don't know could be a storage beautiful one with some barrels good beams yeah and the other premises here you can see the wall here also bricks good and you have some more premises or you can take off this and you can take off this all you can take off all this and you can make just a just a proper in my opinion keep these premises here and there and then take off all this just leave the beams of course because they're supporting beams and use this as a shed beautiful size of a shed <laughs> then you have here yeah the shed start from up up uh, here to there you have here an extra building which is another good like storage you can see some bricks moves not can be fixed you know and you can keep this this premise as a, another another good like a stuff for garden tools or whatever you know and for the barn there you can use it the shed for store wood or whatever you need so i'll move a bit further here just for a quick clarify 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 clarification about the barn again here so this is the building we just been with a spare like a garden tool room and from the beam this up to there it could be like a shed plus two premises you know which is which is really good then we got this piece of garden etc i hope it's clear now and we can go and see 
don't forget one entrance second entrance all this at the back then we go now in front and start from there to see the inside video <laughs> 